find myself a little. Good morning, guys, and welcome back to the channel. I am so, so excited for today. Melanie's excited for today. I'm blue on camera. I'm sorry. It's kind of dark outside, but it is the first track day of the season for me. Today is April 18th. I did not hit 600 subscribers today. If I hit it by the end of the day, I'll still follow through with the thing that I said in the last video, but I, I haven't hit 600, ah, 600 subscribers. Uh, so if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe that. Uh, so if you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button, even if I've surpassed or haven't gotten to 600. You know, just, just help, help me out, you know. Like, comment, all the good stuff. Uh, I do gotta talk about these wheels really quick. The Koenig Heliums that I had in the car. When I hit the wall, I didn't realize I actually broke this wheel. Not like bro broke it, but like I bent it to an unrepairable point. So I actually had to get new wheels. I wanted black and for whatever reason there is no black wheel available ever at all. The Koenig Heliums that I wanted are on back order till June. Um, every other black wheel is on back order. It could not find a single black wheel. I don't know why. So I, I went with these. I actually think it doesn't look half bad. And so that being said, I'm stuck with those until I get the last Koenig Helium and then I'm going to stick a different tire on it. So this video is going to be a little bit of a longer video, so that being said, I hope it's less than five minutes, but written on the screen right now is the time that like the track stuff starts. If you don't want to like listen to me talk and like intro stuff, you can just go ahead and skip to that. It's written on the screen right now, uh, but otherwise, uh, enjoy the video. Um, I'm going to head over to the track. So I made it to the racetrack. Wow, that's not focused at all. Um, I parked next to, next to an ND. Miata. Hi, Melanie. And then there's a little, there's a spec Miata, an NA spec Miata right there. All right, I made it onto the paddock at the track. I'm gonna go get teched in because I'm hungry and haven't had breakfast and I really want to get over to high octane. So let's uh, let's go get teched in. Okay, um, I'm teched in. I'm running red group. I don't know if you can actually tell it's red, uh, which is the first group. And then I have, have it's eight o'clock right now. I have one hour to get back and, uh, and then be at driver's meeting. They do take attendance, so I have to be there quick. So I have an hour to get to high octane and back. So I'll see you at high octane. Okay. So my buddy Brandon's here. Uh, we're at high octane. So like, if it's a Sunday, you can like, you can almost guarantee that I'm gonna be here for breakfast. Um, so this is just my quick uh, breakfast stop. Hey buddy. Howdy doody, dude. It's, it's been a while. nice mullet. Oh, hell yeah, brother. Oh my goodness. He's, he's even got mullet as his license plate. He's, he's ridiculous. Oh yeah. And then I was put in advanced group. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Last time it was an advanced group, Brandon, I hit a wall. <laughs> Alright, see you guys. Carsten doesn't want to be in video, but it's too late. Bye, Carsten. Alright. I don't have cup holders. This is going to suck. I'm trying to get to the track back as fast as possible. I'm not running late yet, but I will be if I don't leave soon. Okay, I made it back in time. Here's Brandon. This, this is, this is, this is, yes. ZR1. Ah, it's a C7. Dude, I'm so excited to see that thing on the track. That's gonna rip. The lost man. Monte over there. Was it Monte Carlo? Where? That one. Right there. No. Oh. <laughs> Holy crap. Yeah, that should be that should be an interesting one. Oh yeah. That's I'm gonna be vehicle right there. Oh is he? Oh I'm gonna be with the MB. I'm gonna be on track with the MB. Oh hell yeah, brother going Yeah. Driver's meetings are always a touch long at Waterford. But that's okay. Safety is important. So I'm gonna give Brandon here the camera. Um he's gonna choose whether or not to record something. Um I'm about to get into grid, uh, to get on the track. This is kind of a shake down of the car because I've I've done a lot to it since the accident. I'm I'm kind of nervous to be honest with you. Send her, bud. I have faith in her. I am gonna take it a little easy just because it is morning session. The track's cold. Tires are cold. I don't know how these wheels are gonna feel. None of it. So I'm just gonna take it a little easy. But I'll of course have to go for running. So I'm I'm actually getting more and more fond of these wheels. All right. See you on track.
Holy crap. GoPro, stop recording. Dude, the car feels so much better than last year. Like, it was a massive difference from last year. I'm so, so scared of T1. But, oh my goodness, the car feels so much better. Holy crap. <laughs> going down the back straight and my tank said literally E and now I have an eighth of a tank of gas. 
Oh, uh, that session felt pretty good. Um, the tires are cold. I'm starting to realize that I'd probably need new tires next time I go because um, they were kind of chattery when they were cold. Like they were hopping a little bit. Um, yeah, I like locked up all four. And I was like, I'm slow enough where I can just make the turn. But I was like, if there's somebody directly behind me, I, I, I didn't even look at my mirror. I just said, if there's someone directly behind me, I'm just gonna go off and do the right thing. I would much rather do that. Okay, so I feel like an idiot because I forgot to record it, but I had somebody sit down in my car and um, and kind of see what I was doing that session to kind of give me some pointers. And then he drove it around a couple laps. So what you saw was me getting back in the car without him. And uh, if you notice, the driving was a little bit different that time. Um, I didn't time that one. I'm gonna time my fourth session to kind of see where I'm at. But I personally feel, it feels weird would have felt a lot better that session overall than um, the first two sessions did. I just, the way the car transferred and everything just felt so much better, honestly. That was fantastic. So I'm really happy with that. Okay, I'm not gonna end it here. I'm done driving for the day. I'm not gonna end it here though, but that was by far uh, the best run I've had today. Sadly, I wanted to have like a tracker or something in my car, uh, but I couldn't get one. But by far my best, you know, session. So I'm just gonna have to go through the old fashioned way of, you know, clicking start and stop on a, on a little timer watching the GoPro footage. But that definitely by far had my fastest lap in it. I'm back home now. I can't remember what I said um, earlier today, but but today was the first track day of the season. It is my first track day since I got in the accident. It is my first track day with the new ball joints, tie rods, and it was my first track day with the new wheels. That being said, there was a lot of firsts today. I'm so exhausted. Uh, what I'm gonna do is 
I'm gonna be uploading obviously this video and then I'm going to just set upload the raw unedited footage of the fourth session so much for watching the video I really hope you guys enjoyed I know this one was a touch longer uh, I said that in the beginning though I hope I can make this like 20 minutes or less though yeah subscribe like comment Hit the notification bell. I'm really tired. I'm sorry if I just seem so unenthused. I really love doing YouTube, honestly. Alright. Bye, guys.